it um brings me back to the high school days. Yeah. You know, for and first when I first got here with Coach Riley, um, I put on a few pounds. You know, for the tight end spot. So obviously, it's a I feel a little sluggish at times, but um, you know I'm, I'm gonna try to shave sh shave some of that weight off and hopefully get back to it. Coach Please. Anderson just said he wants you to say it to 50. Oh really? <laughs> <laughs> well, so did Baldwin. Baldwin. Okay. Well then I guess I'm staying there. Then I know I know my position the position coach Coach Lockett was Kelly you down. Yeah, was saying you know might need to shave down a little bit, uh, and uh, you know obviously you know if the head guy wants me to stay at 250, then I'm gonna I'm gonna do my best to stay at 250. <laughs> Do you like being the, the change of pace back? And I mean, you're out here because you guys are injured, but you definitely give a different look at that position than the other guys. Oh, yeah. I mean, I definitely do give a different look than most other running backs. Um, I, I, as you can tell, I'm, I'm bigger than most running backs. You know, there are some running backs, you know, that are my size in the Pac-12 and across the nation. I think it's a good, you know, it's a good thing to give different looks, you know, the, especially for the defense. you got to be ready for different, you know, any for anything, really. Uh, you know, whether it's 6'4", 250, uh, or 5'5", 165, you know, uh, you know, whatever is best for the defense, you know, giving them a look and whatever is best to help our offense as well. The coach has made it sound like they still see some time and maybe H-back tight end too. It's a little bit of confusion out there for the defense. They don't know exactly what position you're going to be out there at. Yeah, it's definitely confusing, you know, for the defense and a little bit for myself as well because I got to know both and – you know, I'm ready to take that challenge on, you know, anything I can do to help this team, whether it's, like I said earlier in previous interviews, whether it's at H-back, whether it's at running back, you know, even if they put me at linebacker, it doesn't matter. I'm going to do what I can to help out this team. So how much does playing H-back then help you maybe with the screens that you might see as a running back? It, it helps a lot, you know, being able to try to weave through and stuff and, you know, be precise on my routes and keep my eye on the ball, bringing it all the way into my hands and, you know, tucking it and getting upfield. How, how awesome is it then to, to be an Oregon, product of Oregon, and, uh, you know, repping your, your state? It's amazing. You know, a, a lot of people don't get the opportunity to do this. You know, play for the team. You grow, you grow up watching. And it's, it's truly a blessing, and I'm thankful for it. Is it really difficult um, to, obviously it is tough, but having both dual roles and having to know exactly what you have to do with both sides? Yeah. I mean, obviously it's, it's difficult, you know, for anybody in my position, but... At the same time, you just have to suck it up, and you have to know both, and you have to learn the concepts of each play. Not not only knowing what us, what one player, one position has on that play, but the concept of each play that is that's called in, whether it's at running back, whether it's at H back, you know, wide out, uh, tight end, it, either either or. It you have to know the concepts. I think that's the big thing. So Monday position meetings. Which one do you sit in? <laughs> I think for for right now. Uh, I think I'm going to go to the running back position meetings on Monday. You know, obviously that can change at any point. And if it does change, you know, I'm going to be ready for it. Uh, I'm not going to be surprised. <laughs> but as of right now, um, we have a few running backs down, and, you know, I'm going to step up. What did you, what'd you like from the offense today? What, what you saw out there? You know, I liked our, our tempo. I, f I felt like we, we were really up-tempo. We, we, uh, we made our assignments. We made the right reads. And um, we, I think we executed pretty well. You know, obviously there's, you know, a little things, the little things that we can change, you know, um, whether it's, you know, getting on a block or making the right read, um, quarterback, you know, throwing the ball, putting it in the pocket, whatever, whatever it may be. There's, there's things to work on, but I think we did some really good things today. Thanks.